everybody, how's it going? Jonathan here with Automate with Jonathan. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get a uh, list of uh, all the elements that contain a similar link text. Like, for example, in this web page here, if I wanted to grab all or an array of all of the links that contain 2021, okay, and we're going to get all the text here out of each one of these. I'm going to show you how to how to scrape out you know these four items okay so so we have our basic selenium installation here uh, oops some fat fingers from selenium import web driver we have the uh, this by class which is really uh, kind of the heart of this tutorial so with the by uh, library we can uh, scrape out these partial link texts. Uh, the Selenium WebDriver Chrome options is just a, a way I, I set this to be headless and then the service is required to set the uh, your Chrome driver location. But right here, this is this is the heart and soul of what we're doing. Without this, you can't do any of this without the uh, buy. So we have our driver and we're using the driver to get this page. This is just a dummy page on my website that sells a Sony S3 camera. It doesn't actually sell it. If you tried to check out, that wouldn't work. So once it loads this page, we can create a, uh, a variable and store in it uh, this element by, and then here it is, the partial link text. Now, you can see a handful of different methods in here. Link text, if that was exact, if we we're going to do it by class name, by CSS, selector ID, tons of options. But we're doing partial link text because we want to return an array of elements. Another thing to note here is that there are two different uh, methods. One's ele find element and one's find elements. So if you want to return a list of items, make sure that you are doing find elements. And then the value that every one of these elements is going to share is going to be this number 2021 because it's in all of these, these linked texts. And then we just get the, uh, with, in this click button list, we just loop through it and print the text. So let's see how that works. Press play, loads the page, and then it should print out into the console. There you go. The dot text will get it out of the web element and print it there. November 2021, October, September, August. Let's see uh, what else we could probably grab from here. Hmm, maybe Sony. Let's try the word Sony and see what that gives us. So this would be any link that has a Sony uh, in the link text. So that gives us nothing. It was lowercase. Let's see what happens if we make it uppercase. Close out of these. If it's uppercase, what does it give us? See, so it is case sensitive. That's something to be uh, something to be aware of. So that is case sensitive. We just pulled that out. Sony A7. See, this isn't a link, so it didn't pull that one out. It just gave us that one, right? So you got to play around with it a little bit. But that's all you need to get the partial link text. If you got anything out of this video, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and thank you very much.